Yummy, yummy. <laughs> That's the intro. Yeah. And welcome to this video. Today is the last day of November and I think it is about time that we make this apartment look a bit more Christmassy. A few days ago we already bought a tree but we haven't decorated it yet. We haven't decorated anything yet. So tonight let's do that. We just went and bought our Christmas tree and here it is. We wanted one that's not too big uh, but yeah we don't know for sure what size it is before opening it. At least it wasn't the tallest one they had. The last day of November, it means that tomorrow, when it's the first day of December, it's my birthday. Today's plan is to decorate the apartment, to make it Christmassy, and then later I'm meeting up with a friend and we're going to have some dinner and go to the movies. Tomorrow, when it's my birthday, I have actually an office party, so I won't really be celebrating my birthday that much, but it's an ugly Christmas sweater party. And then in the weekend, I'm having a birthday party. Next week is also our anniversary. I thought it would be fun to film a bit of a vlog. Here are all the decorations we can use. I ordered all these Christmas ornaments. I thought this color fits perfectly with the color of our ceiling. So yeah, that's why I went with this color. This is actually the first time ever we've had a big Christmas tree. Let's put on some Christmas music and get to decorating. on the bus on my way to meet up with my friend. We are first going for some ramen, after that to the movies. now over and I'm on my way home. We saw the new Marvel movie Wakanda Forever and yeah I'm soon home. The movie was quite long like two hours and 40 minutes and at the moment it's 11.53 which means it will be my birthday in about seven minutes. I had a really fun last day of being 26 spending it with my friend and decorating the Christmas tree with my boyfriend. The last people I am sharing my moments with as a 26 years old is you guys. Six more minutes. So weird. <laughs> Goodbye 26 year old me. Hello 27 year old me. Four more minutes. I have arrived home but I need to be quiet and it's zero zero. Happy 1st of December and happy birthday to me. I woke up and yeah my boyfriend's already left for work but he has left me a really sweet note saying happy birthday and the apartment is filled with balloons. There's also this happy birthday sign. There's a bunch of balloons here. <laughs> That's really sweet. He's not here because he's had to go to work like super early in the morning. And he has left me this huge bag of groceries. So we are starting off with some palm bears. Ooh, croissants. So I can make myself a lovely birthday breakfast. There's a smoothie and these like macaron cookies. Some strawberry jam to go together with the croissants. Heart-shaped chocolate. I love these. Hummus, vanilla cola, raspberry cola. I wish he was here so I could probably thank him, but I'll meet up with him after work. So I 
have my little breakfast here. One croissant with strawberry jam and one with hummus. Mm. I haven't had croissants in so long. But I do have this weird thing. I don't know, am I the only one? But even though birthdays are usually super fun, for some reason, often on my birthday, I feel a bit sad. I don't know, sad, but a bit like melancholic, maybe is the word. I don't know, I really can't explain it. But yeah, there's often this melancholy that takes over a bit on my birthdays. It's a feeling I only get on my birthdays. It's a bit of like a weird mixture of sadness and excitement and... Can anybody relate? And by the way, when is your birthday? As mine is in December, I'm a Sagittarius for anyone who cares about horoscopes. And yeah, I'm the kind of person who I also know, I know all my horoscope signs. So for anyone who cares, my sun sign is Sagittarius, my moon sign is an Aries, and then my rising sign is a Pisces. It's of course a bit of a pity. I can't celebrate with my loved ones back home. But luckily I have managed to build and create a circle of friends and loved ones here as well. So I'm really happy to get to celebrate it with them. So it's soon time to go to the Christmas party. I just did my makeup. How do you like it? I have a fun Christmas sweater that I'm wearing. Let me show it to you guys. And as you see, it says nice, right? But look at this. Now it says naughty. That's pretty cool, right? I found this at a vintage shop, like a yeah, secondhand store. I thought that was quite a fun twist. So I'm in a bit of a rush because yeah, my boyfriend will be waiting for me. But here you can still see my full outfit with the naughty nice sweater and <clears throat> how should I show you? So I have this dress underneath and these boots but I need to go now. Saturday morning. It's a very gloomy morning. I had to put on all the lights even though it's already like 9 30 but it's super dark. Today I am having a birthday party. Um, the theme for the birthday party is glitter and I still have a, quite a lot to do before tonight. Now in the morning I'm first gonna go for a yoga lesson and then I need to pick up my cake and then I still need to go to the grocery store. I'll bring you guys along for the day. been running from one place to another all day long so my plan is this table here will be like a drink station this table I'm gonna fill with food yeah it's mostly snacks and there will be a cheese board and that kind of stuff the fridge is currently so full that yeah, I still have some things I need to fit in there and it's mission impossible soon I have some friends coming over a bit earlier they're gonna help me with all the preparation so I have just done my makeup I've added a bunch of glitter I feel like I'm going to a festival with all the glitter but I think it looks really cute and I have this completely glittery outfit glittery top and then I put this mesh shirt underneath and then I have a matching skirt I'm now pretty much ready myself I just need to wait for a few of my friends to arrive and we're gonna start decorating together and maybe also have a bit of a photo shoot and take some pictures <laughs>
having some vlogging. Oh, no, I mean, probably oh, to us. my boyfriend's three-year anniversary and to celebrate it we have booked a table in a restaurant called the bishop here in leiden it is actually a michelin star restaurant i've never been to a michelin star restaurant before but i have understood that this is like a cozy place even though it's a bit fancier but it's still like cozy and not you know like an uptight place i'm really excited to try it out and we're probably gonna go you can choose between a four five and six course menu i think six sounds like maybe a bit too much so i think we're gonna go for the five course Hi. 